Hello guys, what's new? Ang sarap maligo. <laughs> Kasi sometimes like pag nagbababad ako sa ano sa bathroom, ang sarap, 'di ba? Ang sarap magbabad ka pagkatapos you use your uh, favorite soap. Oh, 'di ba? Ang sarap-sarap ng feeling. <laughs> Kung pwede lang sana ayaw ko nang umalis doon eh. <laughs> okay, so what's new anyway? <laughs> Kanina lang, di ba? Kanina lang, I have already made my statement this morning. I thought that was gonna be it. Pero dahil may nakita ako dito na, ano, na kumakalat ngayon sa social media, it's actually an interview by attorney uh, Bruce Rivera. Okay? So, uh, dito na lang talaga natin makita talaga na totoo talaga na ito ay uh, girl. This girl has a bipolar disorder. Kasi, She's really full of she's really she's really she's really full of herself. Kasi and uh, as you can notice, she doesn't want to listen, you know. Attorney Rivera is still trying to explain, you know, his stuff, you know, his uh, ideas or whatever she, he wanted to explain and then she just keeps on talking and talking and talking, you know, if possible, she just doesn't want to give any space to to the attorney. Okay, mabuti pa nga yung attorney. Pinagbibigyan na lang niya eh. Pero kung ako, sa kaliman, I mean, there are two people sa isang interview, di ba? So, there is the interviewer and the person who's being interviewed. So, kung ang uh, salita na lang ng salita is the person who is being interviewed, kung minsan pa nga, wala pang question, nagsasalita na siya eh. So, I mean, as if she doesn't need any question because she just keeps on talking and since on so, kahit hindi naman tinatanong kung ano, she just keep herself fitting in. So, okay. Yung ganong, uh, ganong personality, it's not only a person who's got a, a bipolar disorder, okay? Because I've been thinking also, I've been uh, watching or I've been listening to some people who's got some uh, mental defect or mental disorder like that. So, isa dito yung psychopath or yung isa rin yung narcissist. Okay, I can see a person who is a psychopath because a psychopath is somebody who just keeps on talking, 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 talking na, na parang wala nang space. Okay? A normal person, when she talks, she puts herself in a way na kailangan mag-breathe ka muna, kailangan na may space ka, kailangan na you have to make sure na uh, na you are thinking what you are talking about. This person is not thinking what she's talking, she just keep on ranting, she just keeps on going and going and going. Walang katapusan. So, isa yon sa mga characteristic of a psychopath, okay? She just keeps on going and going and then she thinks that she is better than anybody else. She is way, way much better than anybody else. She doesn't want to listen. She only believes on what she thinks. She only believes on what she would like to hear, okay? Pero yung mga, for example, yung mga constructive criticism, she doesn't want that. She doesn't entertain that. And then now, you would know na kung bakit nakaturn off yung kanyang... Uh, comment section okay sometimes as you know as you have noticed on my uh, on my youtube sometimes there are certain issues or certain uploads na kailangan i-disable ko kasi nga naman if i know that those people who are with me on that post ayaw nila na ma-storbo ayaw nila na mabash or whatever so i should really have to understand i should have to respect pero kung ako lang if certain issues like this, it's okay. You can bash me. You can tell anything you want, okay? But if I know that there's really somebody there that I know that they wouldn't want to be bashed, and that's the reason why ilagay ko yung comment section, ito turn off ko yung, uh, i-disable ko yung comment section para at least hindi sila mabash or hindi sila, no? Because they are not that strong, okay? In order to be able to get some bashing ganun. Especially if they know na ako marami kong bash or whatever and they don't wanna be in that position na pati sila ay mabash. Okay? Especially if these people don't know about them. Okay? And then I understand that. I do uh, uh, I do respect that. Okay? Pero ito totally she doesn't wanna listen to anybody. She just don't want to listen. So meaning to say she's a psychopath and also a narcissist. Okay? These are disorders. Okay? If you take a look if you take a look at uh, what this psychopath and uh, narcissist means, well, pwede nyong halgilapin. 
and of course for sure we already know that this girl has a bipolar disorder and that's the reason why we just have to understand that there's a tendency that, that her mood is up and her mood is down kumbaga kumbaga sa isang drug addict kung minsan nakahay siya kung minsan nakalo so she needs some medication talaga na para mapakalma whenever she's really hyper she's really up right there oh di ba baka mamaya ito magbibigti nga talaga because sometimes like if she cannot really get what she wants and then there's a tendency na dahil sa kanyang frustrations and then she can do something it's either she can harm herself or she can harm somebody so uh, at the other level kung alam niya na siya ay depressed and then magsiswitch siya in order to be able to intimidate instead of hurting herself and of course by listening to her explanations regarding her uh, being um, being somebody who was uh, invited at Malacanang kasi nga naman of course you know because she was ranting and of course uh, President Duterte or uh, people in the government who are really in favor of what she's doing so I thought they could uh, take her and invite her and then uh, at least probably they can uh, be able to use her or something okay I'm not I'm not against that okay if they have thought that this person is actually a person that would be able to help them or whatever or they can use uh, if they think that this girl is an asset in order to destroy the other come I mean uh, the the other parties well um, well I don't know if that's the right thing to do because I am sure that if ever there's a problem in terms of the government uh, or political issues, they have somebody there who's really in charge. And naman si, si spokesperson uh, Harry Roque, di ba? Harry Roque, that's the part of uh, of giving out kung ano yung uh, gusto niya ipa, i, ano, iparating sa madla especially when it's coming from the president okay kaya nga siya yung tinawag na spokesperson okay pero if she's being used in order to hurt or in order to malign the reputations of the other parties i don't think it's really right okay especially this person uh right now that we know that she's got this uh this uh bipolar bipolar disorder so i mean the the question is does she have any credibility do we really have to listen to this girl do we really have to take her seriously every time that she goes out there and runs and uh, malign everybody that she wanted to i mean it's not bad to give up some criticisms or whatever especially if you think that uh, there's really something wrong right there but to go out there and run as if like you are the boss as if like you own their minds you own their principles you own their uh their decisions or whatever that's not right i mean i couldn't imagine somebody who would be there you know uh inside the senate or sa, sa congress na somebody would just be ranting at anyone kung hindi siya mag agree because that's a place where everybody has to uh to open up you know to uh, let it all hang loose ko naman problema and then that's the place also for them to resolve things but if there's a certain a person like this na who all she thinks is she is the one who is right and then she runs to everybody pinpoint everybody who is wrong or not and then that's not the right person 